Hello all and welcome back. In this video, we are going to cover Amazon DynamoDB consistency models followed by a quick demo. AWS Global Infrastructure consists of regions and multiple availability zones within the same. AWS automatically stores each DynamoDB table in three geographically distributed locations or availability zones for durability. As the data is distributed across multiple locations, there is a near real-time replication or synchronization of data across these locations. Read consistency represents the manner and the timing in which the successful write or update of a data item is reflected in a subsequent read operation of that same item. DynamoDB currently supports two read consistency models, eventually consistent reads and strongly consistent reads. For eventually consistent reads, an eventually consistent read might not reflect the results of a recently completed write. Repeating a read after a short time should return the updated data. Eventual consistency option maximize the read throughput. The consistency of the item across all copies is usually reached within a second. DynamoDB uses eventually consistent reads by default. Strongly consistent reads. Strongly consistent read returns a result that reflects that all writes received a successful response prior to the read. Strongly consistent reads are 2x costly as compared to the eventually consistent reads. Strongly consistent reads may also have higher latency than eventually consistent reads. They also use more throughput capacity than the eventually consistent reads. Strongly consistent reads are also not supported on global secondary indexes and DynamoDB streams. A strongly consistent read might also be not available if there is a network delay or outage. In this case, DynamoDB may return a server error an HTTP 500. DynamoDB allows the users to specify whether the read should be eventually consistent or strongly consistent at the time of the request. Read operations such as query, get item and batch get item operations perform eventually consistent reads by default. However, DynamoDB will use strongly consistent reads during the read operations when provided with a consistent read parameter which is set to true. In this demo we will cover how to query a DynamoDB table with strong consistent reads. Let's navigate to the DynamoDB console. We already have a DynamoDB table named Movies created with some data added to it. DynamoDB supports strongly consistent reads for read operations by using the consistent read parameter. If we query from the console, it does not provide us the option to set the consistent read parameter. So let's execute the get item on a DynamoDB table using the CLI. You can use the same parameter when using SDK or APIs as well. Open the cloud shell. And let's execute the query using AWS DynamoDB get item. Here we are querying for a single item from DynamoDB with the table name movies. The title set to rush with the string type. The consistent read parameter passed helps ensure that it uses strongly consistent reads. You can also use projected attributes to return only the required specific attributes. 
Let's execute the query. And it returns us the data with only the projected attributes. With this way, you can ensure that DynamoDB always returns strongly consistent reads. So that's it for a quick overview on the DynamoDB consistency models. I hope you liked the demo. Thank you all. All right, that was it. Thank you for watching. You can check out my website and connect me on LinkedIn and Twitter. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. For any feedback, please leave a comment down below. To see more videos like this in the future, hit the subscribe button. Thank you.